My name is George Biketi. Mm -hmm. And what do you do here? I work as a district youth officer with the Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sports. In which district? The Skinango district. Mm -hmm. And how, how, what are you doing today? Well, currently we are doing a practical exercise on uh, mapping and we are trying to map Kinango market. And why, uh, why would you want to map your community? Well, there are several reasons. One, we would like to identify the type of resources we have and that one will definitely assist us in planning. And two, it also assist to avoid, of course, uh, duplication and uh, again, it will, have, uh, it will assist us to know exactly which area needs which particular resource. But finally, when, if we, uh, when we know that, we can also know what we are lacking so that we know what we are supposed to bring. Security-wise, it will tell us where we are bound to have problems in security. And two, from so, uh, to someone who is new, we would like you to act as a guide so that when you are in Kinango, you can know, you can know that um, when I need such and such a service, like for example, when I need to go to a church, this way I'll find a church. When I need, if I need to go to a mosque, this way I'll uh, get a mosque. If I need a restaurant, this way I'll find it. So we'd like this place to be like uh, an area where anybody from the world can visit and feel at home because they can find the map of Kinango on the world map. And um, if most of the people in the community, for example, don't have access to internet, how, how will the map still, or do you think the map would still be useful to have, for example? Yeah, what we're going to do is that um, as uh, the Minister of Youth Affairs, we're going to work with the National Youth Council and uh, our stakeholders who are currently plan international. Then uh, we shall print some of the maps so that we can distribute them to the local administration and any other person who may need the services. And as, uh, again, uh, I expect that uh, even the people in Kinango will soon be on internet because most of the phones that we are getting are internet compliant. So it's a matter of just uh, telling them that, look, you can browse using your phone. Because most of them are just worried, but yet these are things they can achieve. 